So I just want to talk with you about how patient God is. God was very patient with me for a very long time. And he is that way. He is very patient with you, waiting for you to stop sinning, to come to your senses. Like Paul says, awake to righteousness and you must stop sinning. I say this to your shame. You must stop sinning. God is patient, but you also see that sometimes he stops at patience, especially depending on what you're doing and who you're doing it to. Remember where the Lord Jesus showed his anger in the temple. And a lot of people don't really get that. They look and they say, oh, he took a whip, he went in there and he chased him out with a whip and turned over the table. But you have to think about it. Where'd the whip come from? It took him a long time to make that. He had to sit down and actually make it. It was very deliberate. It was premeditated. And he went in there. And he went to such extremes that wouldn't be accepted of anyone else. But he got away with it. So the Lord is patient, but there is, an, there is an end to that patience. If you press him too hard, if you test him too badly, there's a thing that I say that uh, if I need God's mercy, and it's a, it's a song, so I sing it. It's one that uh, the Lord gave me some time ago. And it goes something like this. Have mercy on me, O God, in the way of your unfailing love, in the way of your great compassion, blot out my transgression. Wash away my iniquities and cleanse me from my sin. But you must stop sinning when you ask God for mercy. God will not give someone who is intent on sin mercy. When you agree with him that you've sinned, that is also an agreement to not sin. Because if you really understand what sin is, you must not do it again. And if you do it again, then you call on God's mercy again, and you beg him for mercy, and you humble yourself. Make sure that you're not sitting there secretly hiding, wanting to do it again. And if you do confess it to him right away, Lord, I can't get rid of this. I still want to do it, but I... I want to stop. Please help me. Please help me. Please help me. Throw yourself on his mercy. He's loving and he's kind. And he will not leave you alone in it. He was faithful to me to bring me out of it. He will be faithful to you. May the Lord bless you as you seek him with all your heart.